This video has been created by Retail Business Management Systems. In today's video, we will be discussing the user management functions inside CounterPoint. To access these functions, you can click on Setup, System, and then the Users folder. To add or edit a user, click the Users button, and this will open the user's form. To edit a user, you may use the lookup to find the user you wish to change. To create a new user, type in the user ID you wish them to use. This can be their name or their employee ID. You may use the copy from user function if you wish to transfer permissions from one user you've already created to this new user. For this example, we will be creating a new user. Type in the user's name and select a work group for them. You must also assign them a security code so that CounterPoint knows what permissions they should have. If they will be ringing up sales, you must also make them a point of sale user and assign a security code for their point of sale access. For PCI compliance, check the box to require a password change and you may now set the password for the user's first login. Once you have saved this user record, that user will log into the system using the credentials provided. Next is point of sale security. This is where you will select the security level you wish to edit and check or uncheck boxes to add or remove permissions from the security functions you wish to edit. Next is system security. This is similar to point of sale security in that it has security levels. However, this is also where the menu code for users is stored. As with point of sale security, you may check and uncheck boxes to give or revoke different permissions. Next is menu codes. As with point of sale security and system security, you may have different menu codes for different levels of users. From this function, you can add or remove buttons from a user's counterpoint menu. The next button is user drawers, where you may add or edit drawer assignments and permissions for the point of sale. The last button is user preferences, where you may select a user and change their home button function, button style, button size and color, as well as form options. Thank you for watching this video created by Retail Business Management Systems.